High school reunion. I wonder if I recognize anyone. It feels like I haven't been here for a decade, and at the same time, it, it feels like yesterday. person inside is that is that Sam oh, it's been too long let's see if I can get inside somehow excuse me excuse me could you please move a bit so I can go inside hello hello Guess not. Locked. Hey, hey, Sam! Can you open this up for me? Sam? Hey! Oh, I'm sure he sees me. I'll just try the back door. Sam, how you been, man? It's been too long. It sure has been a while. You saw me just now behind the closed door, right? Why didn't you open it? <laughs> you know why, Mike. Do I? Come on, let's not do this again. I've missed you, though. Do you still remember this place? Uh, I've tried to, but I have to be honest, it's not really coming back to me yet. Yeah... I imagine it must be a faint memory. That's quite the understatement. <laughs> Come on, follow me. Let's see what you still remember. Oh my god, Egg Hunt! <laughs> the memories are already flooding back. Now this I remember. You do remember the egg hunt? Yes! Well, kind of, but mostly this place. Oh, absolutely. We spent hours on end in this place. Mom's garden always seemed so massive that we'd still find unexplored areas even after months of looking. <laughs> do you remember that we actually found some Easter eggs in the garden during May, way after Easter had already passed? And we believed we had uncovered the secret plot of the Easter Bunny, that he doesn't just hide all the eggs on the day of Easter itself, but he prepares them throughout the entire year, one egg at a time. Ah, oh, we spent so much time chasing after every bunny, hoping to find more proof of our theory. Only to realize we just missed a few eggs during that year's egg hunt. And yet sometimes I still believe we're onto something there. Maybe. But I think all the bunnies we chased through the garden were certainly innocent. Let's see if we're still as good in egg hunting as we were back then.
Looks like we still got it. A portal opened up above the basket. Let's see if you can get through it. Whoa, we're back! What just happened? A little trip down memory lane. Yeah, it feels like I was there just last week. But at the same time, it feels like years. Because it was. We haven't been in Mom's garden ever since they moved away five years ago. Five years? Oh. Um, hey, Sam? Yeah? Why didn't you open the door earlier? <laughs> because you don't need me to. But it was locked. It was, but were you really locked behind it? You've always been able to go everywhere I could go. We are one and the same, you and I. <laughs> Do you remember that person I was talking to downstairs? The redheaded boy? That was Liam. I haven't seen him in a year, but it didn't feel that way. He was the first real friend I ever made, right here. And it seems our connection never really went away. I thought I was your first ever friend? You are. Both these things can be true at the same time. It seems like you're still figuring things out, and that's okay. Do you remember this classroom? This was our classroom right here. My table was right there at the window, second from the front. I wonder if it still has the same scribbles on it. Oh, I remember this scribble. We used to play this so much back in the day. It looks a lot more scary than I remember, though. I mean, we're grown up, too. <laughs> Nothing we can't handle. Not sure I agree. Game over. I can just try again though, right? Oh, of course. As many times as you want. <laughs> Great. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> you having fun? Can't complain. Well, that makes one of us.
And we're back. I don't remember Pac-Man being that creepy. Yeah, that's on me. I may have gone a bit overboard. Sorry. I think I'm starting to understand. I'm not really here, am I? For me, you are. When I think of this place, I can't not think of you. You were here with me every step of the way until I... Until I left you behind. <sighs> Come. There's one more house on Memory Lane still waiting to be explored. As long as it's less scary than the Pac-Man level just now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll make sure to dial down the creepiness factor. I forgot for a moment that we're different now. <sighs> Thank you. So, where are we going? We're going home. Yep. The amount of time we spent here is insane. <laughs> Every day after school, all throughout primary, we'd go up here to just hide away from it all. It took a while to build, too. Oh, God. We really weren't the greatest handyman around. Do you remember that we used to climb up here with a little stack of paper and throw paper airplanes into the garden of Miss Miller? <laughs> In hindsight, it actually amazes me it took her that long to complain to our mom. <laughs> ah, she must have been cleaning up paper airplanes out of her garden for weeks. And it's just as big as I remember! Yeah, because that's how I remember it. Massive. Magical. Mine. Ours! <laughs> Ours.
house is still standing tall. Although we should probably mow the grass and pick the mushrooms when we get the time, they've grown enormous. Once you reach it, I think I see the portal at the back door. But if you want to go for another swim, that's fine too. <laughs> it is quite tempting. Yeah, seems like it. Is the water still just as cold? <laughs> no, 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 it's lovely. You should take a dive yourself. Maybe I will. So, I just dipped my toe in for a bit, and it really wasn't as lovely as you claimed. I'm surprised you took another dive so enthusiastically. You either go big, or you go home. Huh, let's try both. Back again. Your eyes seem to have more sparkle in them now compared to earlier this evening. Cause I love being back at our treehouse. I love playing Pac-Man again, and I very much love hunting the bunnies through the garden. You mean the eggs? Uh, right, of course, the eggs. I, I just, I love being here again. Yeah, I get that. But there is one more place I'd like to show you. Awesome! I can't wait! Well, this one is a little bit different. You're not familiar with this one yet. You know I love surprises? Yeah, this one might help you understand why you felt like time has moved so quickly. I have wondered that. It's not scary again, is it? Not too much, I hope. And you really want me to do it? Very much. Okay, then I'll do it. I'm not sure I like this one so much. Sam, what's going on? Sam, are you still there? When you said it was going to be different, I, I didn't expect this. Sam? <laughs> Scared, Sam. Please. Oh, 
let go. Sam, please, I don't want to be gone again. Do you have any idea? Do you know how it feels to not exist? I feel like I just woke up from a long nap and now you're telling me I should leave again. Why? Well, you're out there, moving to a different city, starting a new life. That's not fair. How do you know that I started a new life? Because what else would you do? No, Mike. Think deeper. You were there as well, weren't you? Maybe not the full you, but part of you. <laughs> I won't ever leave you, Mike. You'll always be with me. Instead of an extension, you live on as a part of me. You were the very best friend a lonely kid like me could ever ask for, Mike. You were there for me when no one else was. And I'll always be grateful. You gave me the courage to move on. And it's because of that that this is goodbye. Goodbye, Mike. And thank you for everything. My dearest friend, from the moment you sprung to life in my imagination, you filled my world with wonder and joy. Together, we've explored magical realms, conquered imaginary foes, and shared dreams too big for this world to hold. But now, as the sands of time trickle through the hourglass, I find myself facing a new chapter. One where our paths must diverge. As I bid you farewell, know that you will always hold a special place in my heart. Your laughter will echo in the halls of my memories. Your curiosity will guide me through the trials ahead. And your spirit will linger in the corners of my imagination. So, until we meet again in the realm of dreams and make-believe, with love and gratitude, Sam. <laughs> Goodbye, Sam.